Hello Aquarius, this is your uh, June 15th to the 30th reading. I'm giving two readings today, one general, one love. It will not resonate with all Aquarian people. So let's get started, okay? June 15th to the 30th, 2018 Aquarius. I need a reading for Aquarius. General reading, five card spread. Aquarius, June 15th to the 30th, 2018. I do shuffle these prior, meditate, always on the sign. On each zodiac sign, I do this. See what you got here. Queen of Disc, in reverse. The overall energy is you're dealing with someone right now. Could be an earth sign. It could be a... Uh, a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. They're in, like I said, they're in reverse. The energy is in reverse. It's the overall energy, beginning energy, that someone is not feeling real stable, independent, and uh, solid in their life right now. Let's find out more. Princess of Dis. In the past, they were feeling upright. They were feeling good. They were feeling stable. Princess of Dis. Why are you in the past for Aquarius? Usually a younger person, if it is an earth energy, but it doesn't have to be an earth sign. It could be just someone taking on that energy. Princess of Disc, why are you in the upright in the past? Why are you there? Getting that card a lot for other signs. Change, two of uh, uh, pentacles, um, trying, to, trying to balance things. Um... So in the past, maybe you were trying to balance these things with this other, this earth energy, and it didn't work out. You weren't, you weren't able to balance it. You weren't able to carry it. You weren't able to juggle. You weren't able to control. So, or it could have been them towards you. You know, these energies can be reversed. So, I need an op with the obstacle. For Aquarius, what is the obstacle for Aquarius in this general reading? This isn't the love reading. General reading. So this could have a lot to do with finances, too. Strife in reverse. Maybe with the strife in reverse, the obstacle is either... You could go two different ways, because it is an obstacle. The Five of Wands. When it's in reverse like that, is someone not wanting to battle or no, doesn't want to compete, doesn't want to have a lot of strife, but it's an obstacle. So maybe you did have strife and you shouldn't have had, or maybe you should speak up. We don't know. Let's get another card. Maybe over a, a, an offer, Ace of Cups, an emotional offer, an offer that you love. Maybe it's an obstacle. Maybe you're not fighting hard enough for it. You know? That could be the obstacle. Current environment or the subject at hand for Aquarius. The current environment. Aquarius. The Hierophant could be a broken off... Uh, a relationship. It could be a relationship, even though I'm doing a general reading. A broken contract. Something didn't come through. This is, the Hierophant is contracts, government situations, um, church leaders, leadership in general that's been around a while and uh, kind of uh, etched in stone in society. But it's in reverse. So maybe a contract was broken somehow. And sometimes it is a relationship. In reverse, you know, it's not, you know, taken off. But i got to find out more. The Hierophant, why are you in reverse for Aquarius? Why are you in reverse for Aquarius? It could be a love offer or something you loved. Because that is the Two of Cups. you got the Ace of Cups here. you got the Two of Cups here. So it could have something to do with love. Or just something you loved in general. It could be job, school, you know, family, anything. Okay, what's coming towards Aquarius? What's coming towards Aquarius? What people are, it's either your outside environment, what's coming towards you, what people are thinking for Aquarius. Lover's card again. 
it's in reverse. So um, someone may not be feeling a whole lot of love towards you right now. They're, it doesn't mean they don't love you. It just means it's in reverse. Something became, you know, something went amok. So we're going to do the love reading after this because it doesn't necessarily have to be love, love, but I do see a lot of love cards. Uh, the lovers, why are you in reverse? Someone may be feeling or not wanting to be oppressed. They're not wanting a burden with this lover situation towards you. Maybe they're just feeling like, you know, I can't do this anymore. Or maybe, you know, the whole situation is like that. I need an outcome for this. But you're going to work on it. I just see it's just, I, th I see a little bit of a breakup, but not a permanent one so yet, so far. Let me get one more card, and I can't, I'll tell you in a minute. Eight of Pentacles, why are you the outcome? It's a good card in the upright, someone working hard, you know, not giving up, working very, very hard on something. This could have to do with work also. Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, why are you the outcome? messages you may not be accepting messages you may be trying to work hard maybe you're just not uh focusing on your outside energies i'm thinking this has a lot to do with work also maybe um uh, more work and and not focusing on on maybe a relationship you're more on work or you're not loving work right now could be all or maybe someone's not also because you got that coming towards you the lovers in reverse someone maybe not loving your work even though you're doing uh, you know, you're working very hard. One more for the Eight of Pentacles for Aquarius. And the Princess of Cups. So you may be working with a water energy. You know, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You're working real hard, but the communication is off. So remember that. You know, the key is communication. And maybe um, communication isn't coming through the way it should be. So you may want to watch out for that and, you know, nip this in the bud, as they say. And, you know, work hard, but realize that someone may be feeling like you're cutting them out with that hair font. The overall energy is the death card. So something very well may end in a marriage or a relationship. Overall energy. And you may be just more focused on work, or you may quit your job, or you may choose another job. Because you want some work. That could be that, too. This is a general reading. Let's do the love relationship. Maybe the love one will be better. You do have Mars going through your sign. And that's a fighting type energy. And it goes through. And what happens either you do work a lot. Mars is an action card. I mean card, a planet. And it's going through your sign. So you may feel like I won't work and no play, you know. But the Princess of Cups, maybe the Prince of Cups... Princess of Cups may want some more play, and you may be working too much and may end something. Or you just may quit a job and get another job that you love more because apparently you're not loving something. Okay. Love card. Love reading for Aquarius, 15th to the 30th. Love card, 15th to the 30th. Aquarius, we need love. We need good cards. Come on. Aquarius needs some love. See what we got here. Let's see what we got. Oh, hopefully something good. Three of Swords. Uh, overall energy, beginning energy. There is a choice between more than one person. Something a little heartbreakish in the past. Uh, you had a nightmare situation, but it's it's you're overcoming it. Because it's in reverse. It's the Nine of Swords in reverse. The Nine of Swords in reverse. Look. This guy is up nights. He's crying. He's having a nightmare. And it's, it's all mental. It's in the, it's 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 a mental energy. It's it's really kind of a burden to a lot of people, but this person is overcoming this. Whether it's your energy or a partner's energy. Uh Nine of Swords, why are you in reverse? 
could be over that third, you know, three swords energy, why they're upset, but they're coming out of it. Nine of swords, why are you in reverse in the past? If something didn't move forward. Something came to a halt, the chariot in reverse. Obstacle, what's the obstacle for uh, Aquarius? Obstacle for Aquarius. Offering love and, 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 and coming out of feeling abandoned. The obstacle is maybe you want that cup of love offered or maybe someone else wants it from you and someone wants to come out of feeling abandonment. And maybe they're not getting it just yet. Current environment. So a love, a love offer is being the obstacle. Maybe you're not getting it right away. Maybe you want to come out of feeling abandoned. Let's, let's move on. Current environment, Aquarius, or the subject at hand, Aquarius for your love reading. Current environment. Collaboration. You're trying to work out something. You really are. Ooh, thunder. I don't know if you can hear that. You've got the Three of Pentacles. The collaboration. It's another upright. So it's trying to work it out with more than two people. Let's find out for sure. I need a clarification for the Three of Pentacles for Aquarius. For happiness, you're trying to make everybody happy in the love part. So I see work and love here. You're a little stressed. What is coming towards you? The outside environment, what people are thinking. I need a card for Aquarius. Knight of, uh, Knight of Pentacles is in reverse. So you may have someone coming towards you that doesn't feel real sound and stable. And they're not, uh, it's not that they're a really super bad character. They're just not feeling really, you know, in the upright with you. Knight of Pentacles, why are you there in reverse coming towards Aquarius? So be ready for it. He's in reverse. Knight of Pentacles, why are you there? If it has something to do with the Queen of Cups, that could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So you may have these two people coming towards you. It could be part of that third party situation. I'm not sure you can put it in the um, in the comments, but it's coming towards you doesn't tell me what they're thinking, just tells me they're there. I need a outcome. I need a good outcome. Come on. I need a good outcome for Aquarius. Give me something that's positive. If, you know, hopefully there is. I need a positive ending. Can I have a positive ending, an outcome for uh, Aquarius for June 15th to the 30th, 2018? Wheel of Fortune. It may change in your favor. It's in the upright. And that's why I love reading reversals and upright because I know the Wheel of Fortune is going forward, you know, instead of backwards. Wheel of Fortune. I need a, I don't want to rock the boat here, but I'm going to. Wheel of Fortune. Why are you the outcome? Wheel of Fortune. Why are you in the outcome? You're going to have two different situations to choose from, and it's going to be fortunate whatever you choose. Because you got the two of wands there, making a choice, looking at the world. This man has got two choices, two staffs, two, uh, two rods, and he's got the world, little world in his hand, or whatever they call that. I call it a little world thing. But he's, he's just deciding what he wants, and whatever you decide is going to be fortunate for you. And there's your king of swords, your, your energy, the outcome, taking on your power. So even though things are looking a little rough, you're going to, your fortune's going to change. Maybe you're going to get that collaboration and that, that wish card, that Nine of Cups. And things are going to change, but right now it's still kind of rocky. Uh, you got some pentacles here, like the Three of Pentacles is the current environment. So that collaboration could take a while to work. I'm seeing a lot of pentacles in these readings. And also that Eight of uh, Pentacles in the first reading, in the general reading, that may take some time because pentacles is a slow energy. Even the positive cards. So, we all fortune. Fortune is changing. You're going to make the right choices. And like I said, you're going to take in your personal power. And he's in the upright and he can do it. Okay? Talk to you later, Aquarius. Bye.